Hey guys, Omar here, broker and CEO of Alden Mortgage and Obey Realty. So, mortgage rate update, 4-5-2022. Man, this is not looking too hot right now. And, and um, honestly, what my projections were, if you look at any previous videos, my projections as far as interest rates are going to go, is going to be somewhere between the, let's just say steadily, it's definitely going to be in the sixes, but will it teeter and topple over that seven mark? I don't know, but at the rate that we're going right now, where we're steadily having, let's say 0.1% increases, 0.05% increases steadily, by the end of this summer, going into the winter months, that's probably where we're gonna be at. But let's go ahead and price out five different mortgage products. Now this will be the market rate update on a 30 year fixed, 15 year fixed, 30 year FHA, 30 year jumbo and a 5-1 adjustable rate mortgage. And if you don't know by now, a 5-1 adjustable rate mortgage just means that it stays interest only fixed for five years, then adjust each year accordingly to the cap rate on your product. So 30 year fixed rate mortgage, currently we're sitting at 5.02%, which is actually the high. This is the highest we've been. So today is the highest interest rate we've had in the past two years but we're relatively going on a 52 week range. 0.18% increase from one day ago, 0.14% increase from one week ago, 1.06% increase from one month ago, and 1.64% increase from one year ago. 15 year fix is gonna be at 4.24%, that is 0.05% increase from yesterday, 0.02% increase from one week ago, 0.91% increase from one week a month ago, and 1.42% increase from one year ago. 30 year FHA is going to be at 4.62%, that is 0.20% increase from one day ago, 1.18% increase from one week, 1.12% 1 increase from one month ago, and 1.74% increase from one year ago. 30 year jumbo is going to be at 4.30%, that is 0.15% increase from one day ago, 0.11% increase from one week ago, 0.80% increase from one month ago, and 0.97% increase from one year ago. 5 1 adjustable rate mortgage, this is the highest it's been so for the last two years, three years. We are currently sitting at 4%. That is 0.07% increase from one day ago, 0.05% increase from one week ago, 0.37% increase from one month ago, and 1.25% increase from one year ago. Now, this is why I reiterate in every one of my videos that locking your rate mortgage, locking your mortgage rate is one of the most crucial things you could do because yes, they can go lower tomorrow but the likelihood of it is not really really like especially in this market right if you were if you told me last year hey omar should i lock rate should i lock my rate i'd be like nah it's you know it's really really not that bad because this is why we look this is what i look at every single day so if i see a pattern happening and i know what's happening and i know that the mbs stopped buying uh, mortgage-backed securities uh, the Fed stopped buying mortgage-backed securities and I know what that does to the market, of course, I'm gonna be like, lock, lock, lock. So lock in your rate. If you are in the purchase because your buying power will not be the same buying power today as it is tomorrow, as it is one week from now. And as you see from these interest rates, 1% increase in interest rates could disqualify you from a loan program. So to stay update, go ahead and like, subscribe, comment for up to 50% commission rebate on purchasing your next home, 0% listing fee, and for any mortgaging assistance, link in the description below. Appreciate you guys watching. Until next video, guys. Until the next mortgage rate update.